Mama, mama, why you calling me? Why you calling me, mama? Did you call her? Oh, she called you. But she ain't telling you what she doing. She ain't telling you this motherfucker's in my house, right? What? Mama, please. I, mama, let, I'm not going. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. You know what, mama? I'm tired. I'm tired. I don't give this woman everything her heart desires. I don't did everything she ever asked of me. I don't gave her the best of the best. And she still do me this way. She still do me this way, mama. You're right. It's best that I found out now before we get married. You're right. You're right. Yes, ma'am. She called the police. How you know she called the police? She told you. <laughs> yes, ma'am. Well, mama, she got to get up out of my house. You know, I don't even want to deal with it. Y'all come over here. Y'all get her. Y'all get up out of my house. If I have to, if I have to put her out, she going out in the body bag. No, ma'am. Mama, look, I'm not worried about her fucking nobody. She can fuck who she wants. Oh, excuse me, mama. Please forgive me. She could be with who she want to be with. This is not about my jealousy. This is not about her, you know, uh, doing what she want to do with her, her body. You understand? This is because she's disrespecting my home, mama. That's 3.6 million goddamn motels, roach motels in the whole United States. She could have picked any roach motel to go to. But she going to go in, in the bed, in the house, under the air that I bought, that I paid for? I'm done. I'm done, but y'all better get over here. You better get over here and get out of here. Because like I said, if I have to go in there and get them, they're coming out in the body bag. I love you, mama, but they're coming out in the body bag. 